So guys, we're starting up the latest episode of Pokemon Dark Rising in a battle because I found a Darumaka and I want that little bitch. So I'm going to use Yawn. Muna is also level 9 now. I had to redo a load of stuff, but Muna is obviously male now. So I'm going to let Muna fight this Darumaka. Even though level-wise it's going to absolutely get slaughtered, I think I'll be asleep in a turn or two and then I'm hoping Pokeballs will work from there. I am. I've got Muna sitting at the top of the party doing the um, doing the doing the start of the battle trick. So, so our team now is Muna, Gibble, Staravia, and Darumaka. Darumaka came with something. Raspberry. Burns and PB. So I'm not sure that's the way out, so we're gonna, you know, put a repel on, and we still got the power of the Darumaka, which means that the Darumaka was strong enough to be re relevant to us. Vulpix has drought. Oh man, that might that might have been worth capturing. That seems rare of Vulpix with drought. you I'm not entirely sure where I'm supposed to go in here but that looks like it might be the place Sort out our Pokemon order first. He's level 12, I think, so he's there. But since he's asleep, I'm not going to have him battle. You can catch Pokemon. Yeah. Standard trainer tips right there. Hey, wait up! What's the hurry? Why the rush? Because you're chasing me, Pokemaniac Sammy, with your Torkoal. Moon is just going to use Yawn and then get out of there. Go! Gibble! You're best at handling fire damage. Poison, not so much. Torkoal's asleep now, so he's Dragon Breath. Keep it up, Tork. Keep it up, Gibble. Should have gone for a bite. My recording environment at the moment is kind of funny, guys. Because um, I'm actually recording this in the office as I normally do, and I can hear Metal Gear Solid 2 being played in the background, which is always good. Love that game. Right, fat fella, what do you want? Sometimes you find stuff on the ground, I'm looking for the stuff I drop. Can you help me? No, I'm leaving. Um, I am from Tiki Village. I'm preparing myself for the long road back home. Do you know the evolution stone? Yeah, I know that. I wish Lava Burn Cavern would return back to normal. Me and my boyfriend used to have really fun times in there. Like what? Hee <laughs> hee. Ah! Fucking picnickers shagging. So, it appears what I have heard is true. You are Blake's child. Who are you? Your father is preparing to be sacrificed. He will not exist in this world any longer. What the hell are you talking about? You're not doing anything to him. I refuse to take any chances like I did 27 years ago with your father. I will send you back to the underworld right now before you grow too powerful. Prepare to lose. Better be ready. 
Let's go. So Dark Thug V is attacking us with his Murkrow at level 18. Obviously Moon is going to be a whole a whole shade of useless, so we'll let Staravia take this one. Not entirely sure Dorimaka is going to be all that helpful. Can't say I saw this coming. Otherwise I would have been ready for it. Gonna need Gibble, I think. Send in Darumaka as a to hold hold his own for a little bit. While I use a revive. On Gibble. So Mecca, wake up. Go. No, not you, Moona. Go, Gibble. Dragon Breath. Fight. Crap. Um. Mud Slap. Tackle. Go, Muna! Muna! Just stand there and get kicked in the balls while I use a revive on Gibble. Because Gibble can actually fight this thing. Nice work, Muna! You did a fantastic job as a shield. Tackle attack, Gibble! Got Mistrevus. It's a ghost, vital work. Come on, Gibble, you can fight it. I'm going to use a backup revive on Staravia. And a potion on. Come on, Gibble, you can do this. You're a champion, Gibble. Hold your own, Gibble. One more bite and Mistrevis is gone. And he's got a gullet. Sorry, Gibble. Staravia, you're up. Let's have a wing attack. Follows up with another one. Down. I will be back, I swear it. I'll be back for you, man who's kidnapped my father. Heal me up, Dr. Roy. I'll see you back at that battle. Right then, where were we? Let's go, son. So he's sending out a Murkrow to start the battle. I'm going to use Yawn. Gum! Dark type, yeah. Be careful with dark types. Okay. Doravia, kick its ass. Just continue to kick ass, Doravia, and do it quickly. Well done. Thank you, Riven Endeavor.
up, up comes next is Galette. Okay, this is yours, Daru Maka. I believe it's a steel type. You should have an advantage here. No, you're a bit of shit. Alright, I'm going to use this for healing time then. Good attempt. Staravia, you're up, son. Do it. Do it now. Knock it out. Knock it out. Go on. Wing attack. That thing can't hold you back, Staravia. You know it. Keep knocking it. It's going down. Down goes Golet. Next up is the Mistrevious. I know you've beaten this, this, you've beaten this bitch before. You can beat her again. No, you can't. You're down, Saravia. Up you come, Gibble. Let's do this. Yeah, get yourself some backup, Gibble. You're gonna need it. Mistrevious is a lot more powerful than I thought. Good, paralyzed, great. That gives us a gives us slight advantage. Sorry, Gibble, you're down though. Up you come, Staravia. If you can get one more attack in. Down goes Mistrevious, we win this one. We've won this round. I must say, you disappoint me. I killed you! <laughs> I pity you. I didn't use my full power on you. You're not as strong as your father. What have you done to my father? My name is V. Run along, child. You'll not get any answers from me. What the? He's gone. I really need to get to a, to Flamin City now. Get me into the Pokemon Center. Fucking sharpish. Seriously, I'm going to faint any second. I can do a few more steps. Where's the center? You got it. Right, we'll heal up. Now then. If you talk to the nurse joy in the center as opposed to the doctor you will have a pokemon battle with the nurse the nurse and the doctor in a a double battle now these two have got a magby and a cinderquill so i'm gonna go with yawn and i'm gonna switch to gibble for this battle Now the Cyndaquil is drowsy. I want to do the same with that one. Because once they're both tired or, or potentially going to sleep, Mooney can start fighting them. So let's have a side beam on Magby. Uh, Gibble's got that. Uh, Cyndaquil covered. So now it's just a matter of double teaming the Magby. Side beam from Muna. She'll get a Muna will, Muna will get a ton of experience from that. Don't forget to challenge my sister to your local Pokemon Center. Goodbye. 
In a sub dock. Blue Jimmy? I ain't got any badges yet. I want one. Oh, hang on. He looks like. He looks interesting. Hello, little laddie. I've got a deal just for you. I'll let you have a secret Pokemon. A magic car. Just $500. No. I don't want a bloody magic car. I've got a dragon. I don't need Gyarados. So, no. Thank you. So, we've got a fire type gym in this town. Any free Pokemon going in any of the houses? So that needle ends kicking his ass. Let's try this place. So her husband's a fisherman. Yep, the Elite Four tend to be stronger than gym leaders. That's, what, that's kind of why they're elite, darling. Only a few trainers challenge gym. Lady Inferno, Queen of Desire. That's hot. Did you see a female in that shoe? Yes. Well, she, she's my rival, isn't she? The female in that shoe. Okay, behind his house, something's in it. Well, let's go in, shall we? Ah, oh, the cave's too warm. The other, the other one showed he was worthy. Let's find out if you are. What? Who are you? I'm really getting tired of asking people that. You accept my service? Yes. Hmm. I love how she's using Brock's the build the build from Brock's gym. She's got a black belt as well. Obviously Moon is not at the level to be able to compete yet, so I'll just use my dragon. As the uh, gym assistant says dragons dragon is the best way to go, so I'll just use that. Whatever Magby wants to do, it's going to give experience to Moon at the end of the battle, so that's all that matters to me. I've got a Darumaka. I'll have one of them soon. I've already got one. I mean, I, I, I uh, mistook it for Dar Darmanitan, which is the evolved form of Darumaka, which I'll be having soon. But my Darumaka evolves. Indeed, I will. A lot of fire types do have like poison as a, as a, as a move that they use, so I'm going to use a healative item. Oh, sod it, let's do it. Yeah, don't think I'm weak just because I'm new. I've seen your battles and tactics on TVs. Well, well, you seem like a bright beginner. However, you are too weak to win against me. My fire burns with desire and passion, but also the power of ten infernos. You will not be able to defeat me. So we're battling first gym leader, the fu oh it's just a, it's the it's the Flannery sprite. Uh, and her Volpix has drought. Right. Use your Moona. You could be in on this one actually. Willow Wisp is gonna hurt regardless. If I wasn't fighting a fire type, you'd be burnt right about now, Vulpix. Because Muna has synchronize. But now you're asleep, I can knock your ass out. Handle. 
dark type. Muna can't touch it. He's yawn now. Sorry, Muna, you tried. Go, give ball. Kick some ass. Dragon Breath's got, got it covered. Sorry, Gibbo, you tried. Go, Staravia. Shit. I probably should have healed up before this battle. I'll learn my lesson in future, I will, definitely. So we'll use a uh, wing attack and hopefully... Oh, yes, nice hit. Heat more. Hmm. Interesting Pokemon to send out. It's black as well. It's, a, it's had a redesign by the looks of it. So sure. It's got an electric attack. Since when did Heat more have that? Wow. Shit. Okay. Um. Darumaka can sit in there for one turn while I get Gibble out here. Heatmore has, has electric attacks. It's going to have to be um, Mud Shot then. Mud Slap, sorry. Nope! Gibble got one hit KO! Wow! Christ, you're powerful. Okay. Well, that's about we uh, close off the episode here. I'll do some off-screen training to get our team to a level that can actually compete with this woman. And, we'll, and the first thing we'll do in the next episode of Pokemon Dark Rising is we'll beat the, sh out the, we'll beat the shit out of the first gym leader. How does that sound? Sound good? I think it does. So that's what we're going to do. So, next time on Dark Rising, we've got some arse to kick and it belongs to the gym leader. We'll beat those cargo pants off her. No, that wasn't a sexual innuendo. Seriously, I don't do those. Okay, I do. All the time. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you next time in more Pokemon Dark Rising. Goodbye.